They're made out of meat. Meat? Meat. They're made of meat. Are you sure? There's no doubt about it. We picked up several from different parts of the planet, took them aboard our recon vessels, and probed them all the way through. They're completely meat. That's impossible. What about the radio signals? They use the radio waves to talk, but the signals don't come from them. They come from machines. So who made the machines? That's who we want to contact. They made the machines. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Meat made the machines. How can meat make a machine? You're asking me to believe in sentient meat. I'm not asking you. I'm telling you. These creatures are the only sentient race in this sector, and they're made out of meat. Maybe they're like the Orphali. You know, a carbon-based intelligence that goes through a meat stage? They're born meat, and they die meat. We studied them for several of their lifespans, which didn't take long. Do you have any idea of the lifespan of meat? Spare me. Wait, one of them's coming over here. Gentlemen, is there anything I can help you with? No, we're fine. Uh, staring contest. Right. What are you doing? That's disgusting. They communicate on this planet by flapping their meat at each other. If we're going to maintain our cover, you need to communicate the same way. These meat creatures are so weird. I thought you said they used radio signals to talk. Yes, but the radio waves are used to carry meat sounds. So they have no brain then? Oh, they have a brain, except it's made out of meat. Then what does the thinking? The brain does the thinking. The meat. You're asking me to believe in thinking meat. Yes, thinking meat, conscious meat, loving meat, dreaming meat. The meat is the whole deal. Are you beginning to get the picture? You're serious then. They're made out of meat. Indeed, and they've been trying to contact us for nearly 100 of their years. What does this meat have in mind? Well, for starters, it wants to talk to us. Then I imagine it wants to explore the universe, contact other beings, swap ideas and culture, the usual first contact protocol. So let me get this straight. We're supposed to talk to meat? What is there to say? Officially, we are required to make contact with this race, log in any and all sentient races in this quadrant of the universe without prejudice, fear, or favor. Unofficially, I advise that we erase the records and forget the whole thing. I agree, but can we get away with this? How many planets are we dealing with here? Just one. They can travel to other planets in special meat containers, but they can't live on them. And being meat, they can only travel through sea space, which limits them to the speed of light and makes the possibility of their ever making contact slim, infinitesimal, in fact. So we just let them think there's nobody home in the universe. What choice do we have? It's kind of cruel, but this is a special case. I mean, what kind of species would want to meet meat? Just one more thing. Are you sure that the ones probed won't remember? They'll be considered crackpots if they do. We went into their heads and smoothed out their meat. So I guess we're marking this sector as unoccupied then. I'm calling this case closed.